Rumor, Chicago Bears replace or resign Mitchell Trubisky. The Chicago Bears face uncertainty at the quarterback position heading into 2021, which is why they've been active in trying to trade for some quarterbacks on or rumored to be on the trade market. But with Matthew Stafford and Carson Wentz dealt elsewhere and Deshaun Watson a pipe dream at this point, Chicago is running out of options that doesn't include running back Nick Foles, who is the only quarterback under contract for the Bears in 2021. Which is why some believe there's still a chance that Chicago could bring back Mitchell Trubisky on a short-term extension, despite reports that both sides are seeking to part ways. Pro Football Focus predicted the landing spots for the top 151 free agents, which includes Trubisky at number 67. PFF believes Trubisky hasn't played his last down as a Bear, predicting he signs a two-year extension to stay in Chicago through 2022. Contract analysis, Trubisky will be hoping to follow in the footsteps of Marcus Mariota, another quarterback taken second overall. Mariota signed a two-year, $17.6 million deal with the Las Vegas Raiders that was really a one-year, $7.5 million flyer loaded with incentives. It takes only one suitor for a quarterback to find a nice contract, and perhaps there are teams out there that see a worthy reclamation project in Trubisky. Prediction, Bears signed Trubisky for two years, $15 million, 7.5 MAPY, $8.5 million total guaranteed, fully guaranteed at signing. The argument for re-signing Trubisky stems from how the offense looked in the final six weeks with him under center, including scoring 30-plus points in four straight games. While they found success thanks to a newfound appreciation for running the football, a more cohesive offensive line, and playing bad defenses, it was the best the offense had looked in two years. Although it would probably be best for Trubisky and the Bears to go their separate ways, Chicago is running out of options, outside of trading up and grabbing a top quarterback prospect in the NFL draft. While it's still most likely that Trubisky goes elsewhere in free agency, there's certainly a small chance he could be back in 2021.